Joe Rogers finished third in this year's Mid-State Six Conference meet, but the truth is the Notre Dame senior was the most accomplished diver there. Nobody else could do what he does the way he does it, snailing down the board and then incredibly balancing on one leg, his only leg, before launching himself into the water below. I've always been taught to uh, not so much care what people think, just do what I want to do because I want to do it. And don't go around um, concerned with what everybody thinks of you, if they think you're bad, if they think you're good, if they don't think you should be diving at all. And believe me, I feel there are people out there that think that way. And you just got to look past it. You just got to close your mind and keep focusing on what you're doing. Focus on the positive people around you and feed off them. They feed off you. He doesn't have the power that other divers do, nor does he have the height off the board to allow him to do the dives that other divers can. And yet he can still pull them off. But Joe hasn't merely pulled it off. When he was 10 years old, he lost his leg, a kidney, and part of his colon to fibrosis sarcoma, a form of cancer. He can't wear a prosthesis because of a pelvic tumor that still exists. And yet, Rogers is the school record holder in six events. Imagine what he could do on two legs. Joe has and believes he'd never be this good because, he says, what he lost in surgery, he gained in desire. I think um, the amputation of my leg has given me so many opportunities that I wouldn't, would not do it all over again. All the people that I've met from, all my hardships and everything have been so great. And my friendships now with my teammates and my coach are so strong that I wouldn't take any of it back. When the good Lord closes a door, he always opens a window. And Joe's chosen the window and he's gone on to excel. Joe is probably one of the most positive athletes on the team. He's always thinking about how he can get better, how his teammates can improve, and, and really a, a lot of the reason that my other divers are so good is because Joe has taken upon himself to help them out. Joe's next step is college, where he wants to continue diving off the higher three-meter board. But to those who've seen him, it's hard to calculate the heights he's already reached. 